Microdosing Redditrutide. <laughs> this, this idea is so catastrophically stupid. Redditrutide has 144 hour half life, steady state concentration, where the peptide actually works, takes four to five half lives. That's about 24 to 30 days of consistent weekly dosing to build that therapeutic plateau. Microdosing, let's go over all the mistakes with this. You're injecting so little that the body clears it before it even builds up. Okay, so altering the dosage does not change whether it reaches a steady state concentration or not. Any dose will eventually reach a steady state concentration as long as the dosing interval is shorter than the elimination half-life. So if you inject a microdose once weekly instead of a standard dose, the steady state concentration still occurs at the same time after four to five half-lifes, the steady state concentration itself is just lower. There's absolutely nothing wrong with microdosing retitrutide. I actually can't think of an example where microdosing a new compound instead of taking the standard dose could possibly be a bad idea. Most compounds effectiveness abide by the law of diminishing returns but their side effect risk oftentimes does not, which means doubling the dosage won't double the results, but it may double the risk of side effects or worse. So with microdosing retitrutide, it may take longer to see results, but microgram per microgram, it will most likely be more effective and the propensity for side effects will almost certainly decrease, making it a valid strategy for someone who isn't in a rush to shred down and wants to be extra safe.